Well, I'm just going to make a couple of different shapes or tallish vases now. I don't know how I'm going to get on because I've got tennis elbow. I've had it for ages, I just can't seem to shift it, so. Still got to keep drawing, but it's not very pleasurable. Oh. So these are about just over two pound. The first one's just going to be a, a sort of straight cylinder. Shape. Just center it. Just cone it up a bit into a, so it's a bit narrower at the top. First lift just with my fingers from the bottom. I want it to be a bit narrower, so I'll just basically colour it in right from the base, just squeezing it in and pushing it up. Like so. Now the next one's going to be a bit of a knuckle lift, so I'll put my hand in and lift up from the bottom with that knuckle. So I'll dig my knuckle in at the base. Just lift up. And again, just collar it in. Get it a little bit narrower. And I'm just going to form the lip of it. Just I'll just go in a bit, about four inches down, and just lift up a bit more clay. Get it a little bit taller. Turn over the top a bit. It's not a very exciting shape, but quite practical, really. As a vase. About the water. Sponge the rim. the first shape, like I say not very exciting, just like a tall cylinder. I'll make the next one which is quite similar but it's just a sort of trumpety shape. Narrower in, narrower in the middle and sort of flared at the top. So again, same piece of clay. Time. instead of lifting straight up I'm just going to try and lift it to the sort of shape I'm going to I want the final pot to be. So lift it up, sort of squeeze it in a bit in the middle. And 
straight up. I'll sort the shape out in a minute. So I want it a bit narrower in the middle, so I'll just squeeze in there and let it flare, flow out there. So that gets you the sort of profile, sort of trumpety shape. And again, I'm just going to flare the top over. Like so, and that's it. Tidy the bottom up. So that's the second shape, similar, but just sort of pushed in in the middle and let allowed to sort of flare out a bit at the top. do seem to sell quite well because I don't know really but they do so they're not difficult to make <coughs> excuse me so that's it a couple of sort of vases you might get that in from the same size ball of clay one a straight one one a bit of a flared one just over two pound of clay so that's it folks <coughs>